you can fly with knives as long as they're in your checked bags. But how do you go about that? Well, when I first started out, I didn't know how to go about it. So what I did was I took a piece of fabric. This is a thick placemat I had. And I just take my knives, give it a fold over on the top so the tips would be protected or we'd be protected from the tips and roll it. And then I'd go about and just, I would tape it all around so they were secure, rip open the tape when I got there and just put this container in my checked bag. I then evolved to a knife roll I made myself so my knives can just slip right in there, slip right in, cover up. Then I just roll it up and put it in my checked bag. So those are both viable and very inexpensive options when you're traveling with your knives. Then I moved up to have a metal toolbox, which can still be fairly inexpensive. This one is from Amazon. I found others at junk shows in people's garages that they were getting rid of them. And in here, I would pack my knives. Sometimes I would still put it in a knife roll so they wouldn't move around. Close it up and just pop this into my suitcase. And that was awesome because then when I got there, I could just lift it, take it right to the range. And I'd still have about half my suitcase left for all of my toiletries, anything, clothing that I needed to bring. Of course, you have another standalone solution is for you to get a case. This is my first time using a Pelican case this trip. And this could be standalone where you just have your knives, tomahawks in them. And I'm gonna check this by itself. So you have a lot of options for how you can go about flying with your knives. Tell me what methods do you use to fly with your knives?